You know, the Sims function so well. They're just all going to pass her while she does this. You two, I tell you, are giving me such weird vibes. They claim to hate each other. Yet Cassandra is at prom slow dancing with my boyfriend. Hey everyone, it's Char. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to Whimsy Stories. We are back with Lily. And I've played a little bit off camera. Not too much. Just a day. It's Winter's Eve. Because I wanted to have Lily go dumpster diving. So she found quite a lot of stuff including this computer because why not so she found a simi worth a thousand simoleons and this other simi worth 1500 so we're going to sell those two things and what she also has is these things in her inventory which she also found dumpster diving so i'm gonna sell everything and we should actually be able to get lily an official home there's nothing really wrong with the stove i think she would just have to repair it and clean it but four thousand dollars for a stove is too much she can have a cheaper stove so i'm just gonna go through and sell everything she can keep one of the tvs i'll be generous in that way yeah wow <laughs> we were struggling in the last part but they have to say uh she's not struggling anymore my girl has 1200 simoleons and when i sell this ugly tv she'll have this much so i'm gonna build her a house really quickly i'll see you in one moment oh my gosh that took so much longer than i expected because i really put a lot of love and care the house isn't perfect and i think that lily will expand over time but considering that she started a tent look at her cute little house with the gardening patch in the background all of the trash from the food she wasted my money on it is very 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 cute and i love that lily has gotten to this point in her life i'm gonna focus a little bit on gardening in this episode but for now i'm gonna have lily serve some dinner and she is going to serve a garden salad because i don't need her setting my house on fire right now go forth lily look at you and your beautiful home and per the whimsy stories rules her house of course is full of plants everywhere and it is a micro home she only has 32 tiles lily don't put your earwax in the ew <laughs> but it smells like leaves it's broken but not to worry she'll get it fixed this could be the chance to show the world how cool we are ah well i was gonna have lily uh no put the rug back I was going to have Lily, damn it, I hate that it did that. Okay, I was going to have Lily go to football team sports day, but she can, where are you going? Chat with Bjorn, no. She can go and sneak out to the party, not that she really needs to sneak. Go to college party. Bye, Lily, have fun. Look at her, so confused. She's like, I don't want to go to a college party. Well, bye anyway, Lily. Yes, it is Vinny Vlad. 5,000? I've never seen that interaction, but that's hilarious. Well, now we have even more money. Look at Lily on her feet. Ah! oh my gosh the way vlad just scared the ever-loving shit out of me dude dude i'm deleting you for breaking my tv bye lily lily you need to hire a repair service fitting in lily is getting familiar with the college life so no one even questioned that she was a high school student lily could get used to this fabulous and for the first time in your life lily you will have time to do homework what's this devil smiley face she snuck in successfully. You weren't sneaking anywhere, Lily. You live alone. <laughs> she doesn't need permission to go anywhere. Anyway, let's sit and listen to Lily's annoying computer and see her do her homework. We also don't really need to breed frogs anymore, so we can sell our frogs. Beautiful. And then I'm going to purchase some seeds. I mean, realistically, flowers would make her the most money. We'll go with flowers in the front yard and then we'll do like normal gardening here. Be festive with friends and family and decorate. Oops, sorry, Lily. You don't have any of that. All right, Lily, finish that homework. Stop thinking about babies. You're too young, but you will, in fact, have children with the infant update. Perfect time to start a legacy challenge. We've got some chrysanthemums and then we have daisies, which are worth nothing. So I'm going to plant one chrysanthemum and I'm going to sell the rest. Same is true with the daisies. And then let's have her plant this. Now it is time for you to do some farming. Oh, you need to pee. Oops, sorry, Lily. Okay, anyway, you can be aubergine and you can be aubergine and you can be aubergine. Okay, then we're gonna have lettuce. Oh my gosh, the way that freaking werewolf just scared the ever-loving shit out of 
with me? Why are all the sims out to scare me? Then you can be mushrooms and you can be mushrooms and finally you can be watermelon. Look at my girl living her best life. Beautiful, Lily. You're doing so good for yourself. What are your needs? Fantastic needs. Look at her go. We are living this beautiful, peaceful, happy life in our gorgeous little Mediterranean home. <laughs> I'm so happy for Lily and how things have looked up for her. Winter's Eve was not awful. You got a whole house. We can turn off the lullabies. <laughs> I'm going to send her to bed before she has school in a few hours. No, it's going to be winter fast, isn't it? Is she gonna have school? Nah, it's winter fest. She's very sad, but that is okay, Lily. You can actually cook a grand meal and then I'll have her invite some of her high school friends over. We'll have a nice little winter fest party. Oh, she's also sad because she's about to be on her period. She is on her period. I've got to send her to the wonderful store. She's so dramatic. I love her. Like, look at her autonomously listening to sad music and sobbing over her breakfast. And also I realized that this window is clipping through the wall, so I'll fix that in a moment. Let's have her put up some decorations. Look, beautiful, Lily, you have little twinkle lights. All right, let's throw a party. I'm thinking a dinner party, even though it's gonna be breakfast, it's not gonna be gold. All right, Lily, also I'm gonna help you out here by unpacking this box. Aw, look at her in her little cottage court outfit. All right, it's gonna take everybody like a million and one years to get here so she can at least get herself all sorted encourage crop growth okay people should be here they literally spawn into the middle of tartosa and then walk all the way over uh i said this before in previous videos but tartosa is just a set truly it is uh and it's not very well routed but it's beautiful just living our best little cottage life i love it look there you are oh you're not you it will truly take them the entire day to get here. This one is just spinning in circles on the bridge, has no idea where to go or what to do. <laughs> you know, the Sims function so well, they're just all gonna pass her while she does this. You're here, finally. Don't worry, we're gonna swing, we're gonna sing Wingle Zibs. <laughs> That's it. Let's talk to Cassandra as well. We've gotta share that festive spirit. She's singing Wingle Zibs in the yard by herself. <laughs> Lily! You're supposed to sing around the meal. You want a sexy pose. This is not your man. All of my sims get fear of unfulfilled dreams. Lily, you've been alive for all of four days. <laughs> Lily's just out. Oh, that went very well. They're not even friends, but <laughs> boy, are they into each other. Oh, it's because we're in the tiny house. I totally forget about the tiny house perks. Of course, you would immediately go to my computer. It's fine. Can I give her a Winterfest gift? What do I have to give you? Do you want a hound's tooth dye? Lily, you can talk and eat. It's kind of how a dinner party works. <laughs> She's here so hungry because she keeps putting her plate down. Oh, they're all dancing. Perfect. Do you like it, Cassandra? <laughs> Beautiful. All we need is Father Winter to give me some expensive gift. This feels like such a teen party. I love it. I'm living like my Sims fantasy. <laughs> the difference that a single episode can make in Lily's life. I feel like I should have her flirt with Dawson for fun. It feels like a very teen thing to do, even though she's really sad. Lily, you are literally like 15 years old. What do you mean purpose of life? Oh, it's time to watch a scary movie. I feel like these two would be a cute couple. I don't know. Luna Villarreal and Cassandra Goth. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think? I'm kind of seeing it. And the beautiful part is because we're in a tiny home, we will all be best friends <laughs> by the time this party is over. Oh, she's cramping. If only you had a bathtub, Lily. I could eventually get you a hot tub. Wow. Why did I think his name was something else? Trevor wants to go to prom with Lily. Of course. Prom is tomorrow. Oh, we'll have our first prom in this episode. I don't want Lily to end up with the first person she's interested in, which is why I wanted her to start as a teen. But let me know what you think of Trevor in the comment. I think he's a cute first boyfriend in the sense that I think it'll be an adorable relationship. You'll see Lily joining an after school activity. And if you do, what activity do you see her doing? I feel like she'd have like an after school gardening club, which I think could be very cute. Trevor has the lover personality. I could tell that by his romantic trait. I think, yeah, they can already have their first kiss. <laughs> the idea of them doing that at this party is very funny, especially because she lives in a tiny house so that everybody can see them. There's like three rooms in the whole house. Cute. Look at Cassandra here to cheer us on. <laughs> okay, fabulous. 
Cassandra doesn't like Trevor. Oh, that's awkward. And Trevor doesn't like Cassandra. But Lily likes gardening. <laughs> that's what this conversation is about. Oh, she does not like that Cassandra doesn't like them. Okay, cool. Anyway, thank you all so much for coming. Get out of my house now. Bye-bye. We could go to the Festival of Light. Why not? Let's go, Lily. No, you all stay behind. Bye. I'm going to make some new friends now. I feel like Lily would have a big friend group. Let's look at this beautiful Festival of Light. Love it. Love it. Lily, come stand here. No, stand here, Lily. Look the other way. I'm going to have her take a selfie because I have selfie overrides. So she's going to look so cute. Look at you looking like a babe. Oh man, I don't think I'm going to get the full rotation. You can kind of see it there in the background. So I'm going to go with this. Hello. I like your blue hair and your purple lipstick. It looks real cute. No, Cassandra. Sorry, I'm in Japan. We'll get pep talk and then I'm going to run to the bathroom because Lily will definitely pee her pants. Ooh, I can purchase a semi capsule and a festival kimono. Oh. Lily, please don't get sick. Oh no, okay. She's just dizzy because she's on her period. Is it expensive? Father Winter, how much are you worth? A hundred simoleons. I mean, that's double the profit. Can I come and talk to Yamachan? Yeah, sure, Cassandra. We can be besties. Lily has a good reputation. Cassandra came all the way to Japan to hang out with us. I love this. We're having a good time. Are you a teen? No, you're a young adult. You know, I could have older friends. Hello. I also see Lily being a babysitter if she doesn't join an after school activity. I don't see her having a million and one kids, but for this challenge, I see her having at least two or three kids. You're the mail carrier. Sweet. All right, we've had a lovely time. Thank you so much for hanging out. I'm going home to see Santa Claus. Why are you still here, Trevor? Go home. Hi. Okay, I'm gonna clean up and then I'm gonna purchase more flowers. I'm loving all the cozy vibes. I'm aware that Lily's kitchen does not have a sink, by the way. Uh, I prioritize counter space. She could use a sink in the bathroom. Of everything here, I think I'd like her to plant grapes the most because the other stuff will turn into trees. Ugh, more cheap flowers. I guess we'll plant a bluebell. Don't think this pergola will actually stop this from getting hurt by the rain. <laughs> But I'm hoping that it will. So we can recycle this and we can recycle, I guess, just that. And she can make a sky dipped candle. I feel like Lily is finally living her best life and I'm so happy for her. Get some leftovers and then I guess you can go to sleep since it doesn't look like Father Winter is going to give you any gifts. You've got to see this. Okay, so Lily is here eating her dinner, but then if we turn around and look at what Lily is looking at, this, this is her view as she eats her dinner. How beautiful. She is really out here just having an amazing time with that big, beautiful full moon. Oh, I'm having such a fun time with Lily. All right, good night, Lily. You have prom in the morning. All right, Lily. Up and Adam, it's time to garden. Sure, Trevor, we can be best friends too. We'll just have one giant friend group. I do want to get lately a yoga mat. I'm going to say something like here-ish. Maybe a little meditation stool in the front yard. Love that. All right, Lily, you finish your gardening. Yes, Cassandra, what is it? This is awkward because Trevor and Cassandra don't like each other. But you know what, y'all? I will see you both at prom. <laughs> We've got things to do. Lily's focusing on her aspiration. I will... Will Lily be his girlfriend? Yeah, why not? <clears throat> First boyfriend. Um, I will put Lily in an after school activity at some point, but I'm going to wait for your feedback on that to see what you think she should do. You two also give me suspicious vibes. Very suspicious. Okay, y'all. Well, it was so lovely to hang out with you. I've got to go and work on my aspiration. So I'll see you at prom. Fabulous. We're here at this restaurant, but we're not actually here to eat. I'm here to... This dumpster is empty. How dare this dumpster be empty? I need stuff to collect. All right. The dumpster diving this time around is not to make money, but rather to just find a bunch of stuff that we can recycle. I'm going to put this in the inventory. I'm going to... Pop this in my inventory too, because I'm sure I can recycle that. Sandra, you better get away from this dumpster. No, I already have a prom date, Cassandra. I remember it's Trevor. Now, excuse me, I've got to make a living here. No, I'll see you at prom. She found a couch. Great. Beautiful. Okay, so it doesn't count it per item. It's just literally how many times I click on the machine. So we'll also recycle this recycle trash pile lily if you're cold girl put your 
cold weather on. She hates the recycle machine. <laughs> Sorry, Lily. You're a whimsy sim. This is your life. Beautiful. You've only got to recycle one more time, Lily, and you have a recycle trash pile to help you do it. Beautiful. Great job, Lily. Now let's go home and get you ready for prom because, girl, you're going to stink. Trevor, you're still here. I'm going to take a brisk shower. She might have just enough time. She doesn't have another wax cube. That sucks. She can't recycle. And I don't think she can fabricate. Oh, she can. Um, can I fabricate this bookshelf? I want it in Canary. Hey, Trevor just likes that we have our own house. He's always here putting stuff on my shelf. I hate when they do that. Lily, resume this. You have prom in like an hour. Oh, never mind. Promise now. Let's go to prom. Beautiful. We're here. Everybody get inside. Don't freeze to death. Hugo, hello. Let me just talk to all of the Sims. My prom date. You two, I tell you, are giving me such weird vibes. They claim to hate each other. Yet Cassandra is at prom slow dancing with my boyfriend. So Yuri, do you want to see my beautiful outfit? Actually, Gemma. Yeah, Lily, you can like dancing. Here we go. Show off your outfit. How are you cold? We're inside. Okay, and then I'm going to sweetheart together. Sweetheart dance together with Trevor. Ah, now Trevor's just dancing with everybody. No, it's fine, Trevor. I didn't want to dance anyway. Aw, Yuri's upset because someone died. Girl, somebody's died. Why are you at prom? Look at my prom dress. I'm counting that because I did it. Sure, we'll sweetheart dance in this little corner. This music, for sure. <laughs> the prom award ceremony is starting. Am I going to win? Sandra, you real? You're going to freeze to death in this gym. Gemma Charm won prom royalty and Wolfgang Munch won prom jester. Congratulations to you both. I've got to use this photo booth. Woohoo with Trevor. Ah, uh, no, no, no. Take a nice happy photo. Lily, you're also hungry, so grab a survey. And I think Lily would want a picture at her first prom, so I'm going to have her... Oop, we're in a wall. Go here so she can take a picture. Why are you sitting on the floor? Lily, I'm going to have to go with this shot because <laughs> it shows the background of the prom. Everybody leaving. Maybe I'll do like this as well so we can just have the memory of lily's first prom anyway it's time to go let's keep the party going yeah okay mira you're so cute oh my gosh girl you're adorable you're all freezing cold anyway can i ride this ferris wheel oh trapper didn't come i'll ride with mira look at us just having the best social life oh you're a babes 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 i'm gonna help you out here because so many sims died in the first episode let me just change your outfit here in the next part maybe we'll focus on deepening a relationship with these sims starting like a gardening club or having lily join an after school activity she really has to pee so it's gonna be embarrassing if she pees her pants she's feeling distant it's almost like she heard me say i'm just gonna have her make more friends and she was like no so i feel like this is the perfect spot to end today's part thank you so much for watching this video i really appreciate you being here i had so much fun playing with lily and getting into the more cozy elements of this challenge let me know what you think of trevor in the comments below as lily's first boyfriend do you see them being more long term and also let me know if you think lily should join an after school activity and what activity she should join or if she should get a part-time job open to suggestions i will see you in the next part bye